Pi now available in multi-sig wallets, unlocking new possibilities for open mainnet Pi apps. The Pi network has revealed plans for secure multi-sig wallets to increase security and simplify transactions within mainnet Pi apps. This improvement promises enhanced asset security as well as new opportunities for Pi app developers and consumers. A multi-signature wallet is a cryptocurrency wallet that requires many signatures to conduct each transaction rather than simply one. Signatures are associated with several cryptographic private keys, and a transaction must be signed by a certain number of keys in order to be validated. Investigating the potential of multi-sig wallet integration. As the world of decentralized applications, dApps, expands, developers are always looking for ways to improve security and user engagement. To address these expectations, the Pi Network announced intentions to launch a secure multi-sig, multi-signature, wallet mechanism for mainnet Pi apps. These wallets will provide exceptional protection for Pi assets while also streamlining transactions across pioneers and apps. Pi Network announced on June 28 that multi-sig or multi-signature wallets for mainnet Pi apps will be released soon, giving developers the chance to improve the security of the Pi received and kept by their apps. Wallets with two compartments, receiving and transmitting. The new mainnet Pi apps mechanism will keep two wallets active. The first is the receiving wallet, which functions similarly to a savings account and allows developers to collect Pi from app users via Pioneer to app payments. The second is the sending wallet, which is similar to a checking account and is used to pay pioneers. The multi-sig cold wallet serves as the receiving wallet. The receiving wallet is a multi-sig cold wallet that will safely hold the majority of an app's Pi reserves. This offline wallet requires multiple signatures for transactions, which strengthens the security of Pi assets. This technique increases security by requiring many members to sign off before dispatching any Pi. It also aids collective team governance by requiring several members to sign off before dispatching any Pi. To increase security, developers will not be need to enter any linked passwords online, ensuring that hackers cannot access the app's core Pi reserves even if the server is compromised. The Sending Wallet App to Pioneer Payments Made Easy The Sending Wallet, on the other hand, allows for automated app to pioneer payments while acting as a conventional wallet without the multi-sig capability. Wallet, unlike its cold wallet sibling, can exist on the application server, and the application code can use its secret seed to speed up transactions. To safeguard outgoing funds from the receiving wallet, developers must feed the sending wallet with pot. Because this wallet allows for automatic transactions, developers are recommended to limit the Pi balance to meet daily payment needs and to reassess this amount on a regular basis. The Pi apps ecosystem is being revolutionized. Mainnet Pi apps will undergo a makeover as a result of the combination of these two wallets. The receiving and sending wallets support Pioneer to app and app to Pioneer payments, allowing Pi app developers to unlock new functionality and business models. These wallets will fuel the Pi app ecosystem's growth by improving the security and transactional flexibility of Pi reserves, allowing for the development of diverse use cases for the Pi coin. Developers and pioneers should keep an eye out for future instructions on how to apply for and set up these developer wallets. The launch of the invention marks a key milestone for the Pi network, demonstrating its dedication to user security and the development of a robust app ecosystem. As the world waits, it's apparent that these developments will pave the way for the future of Pi apps when open mainnet becomes live. This is it for now. Please kindly like, share this video, and subscribe to this channel. Till the next video, bye for now.